My name is Eric Lenning. It's a little before 1 o'clock on Wednesday afternoon, June 12th. I want to take a few minutes to bring you up to date on the latest thinking regarding the severe weather expected later this afternoon. Uh, we do believe that there could be a significant threat of severe weather later today. This would include damaging winds well over 75 miles per hour, large hail of golf ball size or larger, uh, a good possibility of tornadoes, and also a concern of flash flooding. Uh, the timing on this would be mainly this afternoon and evening, most likely in the 4 to 7 p.m. time window for the Rockford area. Potentially some isolated severe storms earlier than that, maybe around 2 p.m. Um, and again, uh, for Chicago, 6 to 11 p.m. this evening uh, would be the primary window, and there again could be some isolated severe storms as early as 4 p.m. SPC has us in a high risk of severe weather for their outlook. This is the first high risk of 2013 across the country. Uh, the combination of hail, tornado, and wind expected. Uh, the <clears throat> hail threat would be across the area, and the black hashed line would show where a potentially large hail of two inches or diameter uh, or larger would be possible. Uh, the tornado threat is most focused across northwest Illinois into eastern Iowa, but uh, there is a uh, reasonable tornado threat uh, extending into northwest Indiana as well. As far as uh, severe and damaging winds, that uh, extends from eastern Iowa all across northern Illinois, across northern Indiana, into northwest Ohio. And uh, the winds are the primary concern in terms of the high risk, but uh, we certainly don't want to discount the tornado and hail threat. Uh, in addition to the tornadoes, hail, and damaging winds, there is a likelihood that these thunderstorms could track over the same areas repeatedly, uh, potentially uh, dropping as much as two or three inches of rainfall across northern Illinois, northern Indiana, into northern Ohio. Uh, the primary threat locally would be along north of the I-80 corridor, and again, this would be mainly late afternoon through, through midnight. The weather map today shows low pressure lifting out of the uh, central plains with a front extending to the east. The front is going to be the focus for the thunderstorm development as well as the spinning thunderstorms and also the tracking of storms from west to east over the same area. So uh, the combination of the frontal zone and some winds aloft and the, the heat and humidity this afternoon would all be the factors that support severe weather. Again, uh, becoming very warm and humid today with thunderstorms developing toward early to mid-afternoon. Uh, scattered thunderstorms across northwest and north central Illinois. Eventually toward late afternoon we think uh, large hail and damaging winds become a possibility. Uh, tornadoes also a very good possibility, especially across northwest and north central Illinois. Uh, toward late afternoon into the evening we think these thunderstorms are going to start to merge into a large complex and damaging winds would become the primary threat, but heavy rain is also uh, going to be a concern. Once again, it's about a little before 1 p.m. on Wednesday afternoon. Uh, thank you for joining me. The forecast information could change at a later time, so be sure to check back to our website, weather.gov slash Chicago, for the latest information. And always be sure to stay tuned to No Weather Radio and local media for any watches, warnings that may be issued.